Hello there, this is Ron Wills coming back at you with yet another video. When a woman doesn't get past a handsome man's looks. When a woman doesn't get past his looks. Now, you know in the last live video I did this past Friday, I said, uh, you know, sex appeal uh, goes beyond looks, right? Sex appeal goes beyond looks, but I said there were some exceptions. I said there were some exceptions. And just in general, when you're talking about relationships, there's no science to it. Any, like people like get caught up in studies or they say it's a science and they measure them. You know, it's an art. If it, if it was a science, anything about relationships was a science, I wouldn't be discussing it now. There wouldn't be any problems. The thing about science is once you establish it, it's always the same. One plus one always equals two. A is always A. You know, water always boils at a certain point. Water always freezes at a certain point. It's an art. So no matter what I say on here, even with body game, whatever, I can only speak in generalities. Anybody can. It's more of an art. You know, so no matter what I say, there's always going to be an exception. I can talk body game all day and all of that, but then there's somebody who's not in shape who's going to have a ton of women. It is what it is. So when you talk about looks, yes, for the most part, a man needs sex appeal beyond looks to really get a woman. But you have some women out there who don't get past the man's looks. And it ain't even about sex appeal. See, that's the thing. It's actually a problem when a woman is like just totally, totally just into his looks, nothing else. That's not a good thing for the man. So you get some men thinking, oh, well, OK, if I got that, I can get that woman. That's all I need. No, no. Remember what I've always said. It's better to have a woman's respect than her love. See, when a woman doesn't get past a man's looks and he has to look a certain way, it ain't about necessarily the man. It's about him being a trophy to a, a prize. Like a lot of women who might be otherwise unattractive actually get into that more. Now, those are the occasions when you see the lesser woman with that real handsome man. Now, remember, once again, it's, it's an art, not a science. What did I say? For the most part, Women want to be the better looking one in the relationship for the most part. But you do have occasions where you get a woman who ain't looking like all of that, but she's with that real handsome man. It's all about it's a trophy. And it's really about her vanity in that case, because, OK, this woman, shoot, she been unappealing since she was young. She knew it. She she accepted it. But she'll get that handsome man. She'll get that handsome man as validation for her. You say, oh yeah, well, I can't be that ugly if I get him, if I get that man. Indeed, it plays a part in the gigolo industry and male exotic dancing industry. Because let's be real about some stuff. Some of the women who be throwing money at these guys and paying for it ain't all that. You do get some beautiful ones now, let, let's be clear on it. But then a whole lot of them are like, yeah. They couldn't get a man otherwise, so they will pay for that man. He's the trophy. He's the toy. In fact, some cougars will use that boy toy and stuff. It's all about it's all about them. It's all about the prize, and it's about how he looked. It ain't so much about the sex, because if it was about the sex, psh, they going to get the guy behind closed doors who's going to tear them up. No, this is the guy that they can parade around with. This is the guy they can walk with, hold his hand, and show everybody. Like, you get a lot of women who make a lot of money, and they get those boy toys or that real handsome dude, and they go to that, uh, you know, they go to that uh, party or event or whatever, and it's just like, yeah, they're with them. In fact, that happens a lot with a lot of professional women. A lot of professional women, if you had any event, if they not married to the man, oh, it's a good chance he was a gigolo or uh, what I would call a street type of gigolo or just a good looking guy. It's all about his looks. Like I said, it ain't about the sex and what goes on in the bedroom. Shoot, the sex in the bedroom could be lousy. It's strictly, when she don't get past his looks, it's strictly about the superficiality of it. It's simply about what they can be publicly. Because trust me, 
if you get an average or even ugly woman and she ain't getting past that guy's look, oh, she's gonna make sure they out all the time. She will pay. She will pay. And like I said, in the bedroom, the sex might be in, but she don't care. She'd be like, whatever. She probably have a she probably has a side piece who she might call ugly sexy. His job is to tear her up, but act like he don't know her in public. See, when a woman don't get past the man's looks though, it's all about that prize. It's all about what she bring into him as far as what the public sees. She, he's the trophy. He is the trophy. And I'm gonna tell you what, a man shouldn't even want that. A man shouldn't want that. Now, if he do it because she actually paying for stuff, okay, I can get that. Even though, well, it, there's a, I tell you, I, I'll put it like this. There's a, a lot more discussion need to be about taking money from women. A lot more discussion, so I'm not gonna get into it here. But she, she don't really see that man. She don't care about his opinion. She don't care about what he can do as a man. Shoot, she got the money in most cases, you know? He's just an image to her. He's just an image. Like if a man gets caught up in that situation, he feels like it, it would behoove him not to like catch feelings. Cause she ain't catching feelings for him. You know, she ain't concerned about what he doing. He's the property, he's the trophy, you know? He's the shiny object to, to really make her look good. Like I said, a woman like that, shoot, she had this guy to walk around with in public and stuff, and then be still getting like tore up behind closed doors by some guy who wouldn't stand out as much physically. That's just, hey, that's just how it can go. So, you know, is you know, because contrary to popular, well, I've said it before, it's not always emotional when women are dealing with a guy. Sometimes it's business, it's that price thing. You get some women who, they, just like you get some rich men who want that trophy woman, a lot of women want that trophy man, you know? Now, like I said, they ain't all of them, of course. And in, in most cases, it's still a case of women prefer to be the better looking partner, you know, especially if it's in a relationship, you know? Like they still might deal with a better looking guy if it's a quickie, it's a fantasy. But when we're talking about, that's still behind closed doors. When we're talking about in public, she's walking around with, she's going to parties with. She, in fact, some professional women, they might get that really good looking guy and actually coach him on what he need to be talking about. Let me say that again. She might actually coach him. And in fact, if he's at like some situation where it's a bunch of professional women, they don't look that good, all they got is money. He's the boy toy or whatever, shoot. He might not even really be allowed to talk. You know, they might ask him something, be at the table or something, you know how they are for those who've gone to those things. And you know, you wanna talk about some stuff. You, you gonna talk, you gonna be at a table. That's part, that's part of that whole dynamic anyway. And when you talk about more upper class events and say somebody ask him a direct question and he might start to talk, she'll jump in because that she, she ain't worried about like what he doing for a living. She ain't worried about his per personality beyond being able to go along with her plan. He's a prop. He's a trophy, you know? He's a prize and you know, every now and then it could be a prize for, her. not so much a sexual thing, but even just for her own self-esteem. Like she wasn't that attractive woman, but hey, she got this real handsome man makes her feel real good, right? Because I'm gonna tell you something, as a man, a man is about action, and a man should always get respect, you know? Yeah, she think you look good, but if you be with a woman, she should be just as concerned about your character and what you bring into the table as far as your personality. What are you doing? Who are you as a man? You know, if she's just concerned about your looks and nothing beyond that, you're a bitch. I want y'all to think about that, okay? So anyway, that's all I have for now. I'll get back with y'all. Peace and blessings.